everyone. So real quick today, I just wanted to talk about some music favorites because I have not talked about music in a while and I wanted to do that. Um, it is in fact little because I can't pick 10 songs this time around. I've only got eight for you, which is unfortunate, perhaps fortunate because then this won't be such a long video. Yes, without further ado, I'm going to get into the video. And of course, as always, the playlist will be linked down below in Spotify. I'll also have these songs listed in the description as well. So, okay, let's go. Also, please forgive the puffiness of my hair. It's raining today and I did not feel like straightening it. First song I want to talk about is called Take Me Home by Germany Germany and I have recently discovered this artist. I really, really, really am into them so far. I think if you're a fan, I think if you're a fan of like Tycho, um, you would also like this artist. It's usually instrumental music. This song has a couple um, vocals like towards the end but nothing really major but I really just enjoy the beat of it because it's it's dancey but it also kind of reminds me of I don't know like a band I would have listened to in middle school or something minus the kind of angsty lyrics or something. That doesn't make any sense but um, I think it's a good opening track as well so just just trust, okay? Next song I'm gonna talk about is Straight Through by Zolo. And I found this song through um, a Close Encounters video. She used it as background music. I dig it, it's shoegazy, totally up my alley, and I think you would like it. If you are a fan of Wild Nothing, Beach Fossils, Dive, stuff like that. So yes, very, very straightforward, easy to listen to, good song. Third, we have Flashbulb Eyes by Arcade Fire and everyone loves Arcade Fire, of course, but I really want to mention this song because it's definitely not like their other stuff. Um, it came out back when Reflector came out, but I've been revisiting it just because it's better for, you know, the warmer season coming, I feel like, even though today's a bad example, because as I said, it's raining and kind of gross outside. I like this one because it has like a vibey kind of trap influence to it. Very different from Arcade Fire's other stuff, but I'm into it. I can listen to it on repeat to be quite honest. Um, next song I want to talk about is William Cannon by Masita, and this is an artist I discovered because of Julia's mixtape, so shout out to Julia if you're watching, but yeah, she put this song on there and I'm really, really into it. I ended up listening to basically Masita's entire discography, discography, dis as in like a list of all the disses they've done, no, discography, and um, I ended up listening to their radio station as well, and that's actually how I found the Germany, Germany song, so yeah, just kind of a like danceable indie pop sounding band is what I would describe Masita as. So there you go. Next is the song of this summer. I am calling it right now. It is the Young Blood by the Naked and Famous of this summer. It is the Midnight City by M83 of this summer. It is the Home by Now by Bombay Bicycle Club. I can just feel it. And this song is Pay No Mind by Madion featuring Passion Pit. It's been out for a while. Madion's new album actually came out recently and it is bomb.com. Almost start to finish. There's only a handful of tracks that I would skip. Not even a handful, probably like a couple, but it has obviously Passion Pit featured on there. It has Dan Smith from Bastille. It has um, Mark Foster from Foster the People. Passion Pit has a new album coming out as well. He's been dropping a lot of singles like 1985. I'm sure a lot of you have heard that by now. Where the Sky Hangs and just a lot of fun stuff. So I think it's good that these guys are collaborating right now because it's good promotion for both of them. But at the same time, this is honestly just a killer, danceable, driving song that is, it is everything. It has stolen my heart. I'm sure it will steal yours. This morning I was listening to my music and it came on and I was like, oh, I should skip this song. I listened to it too much and my finger went to the skip button, but I just, I couldn't couldn't press it. Uh, next song is Pull Me Back to Earth by Friendly Fires and I'm really really into this band right now as well. I've been listening to their album Pala a lot and this song I feel is just a very dramatic sort of production of a again electronic kind of danceable song. That's kind of what I listen to if you haven't noticed um, along with indie rock but I more so have been into the electronic stuff lately. Next is actually a more indie rock sounding song and this is You Take It Slowly by Telekinesis and I have missed Telekinesis greatly. This is off of his album that came out in 2014 that totally slipped under my radar but I have been listening to it and it is awesome. The album is called um, Dermarion but yeah very good if you've liked any of his previous 
previous stuff, you'll still like this for sure. It actually really reminds me of Brightener, Will Sturgeon's project, whose music I've used on this channel before, if you're familiar with this channel. Kind of just like a beachy, indie rock, cool vibe sound and stuff. I don't know. I'm into it. I dig it. And then finally, I wanted to mention the song Particle Board from Reptar's new album, which is called Lurid Glow. And I will be seeing them next Tuesday. I'm super excited because I have been wanting to see them for a very, very long time. I love Reptar. They are one of my all-time favorite bands. And I'm not gonna lie, this new album is... Uh, it's still growing on me. It has yet to fully develop marinate with my ears, but there's definitely a couple songs on there that I dig for sure, this being one of them. Um, however, I am probably a bigger fan of some of their older stuff, but I'm not going to write it off completely just yet. I will perhaps be really into the songs after I see them live, so who knows? Who knows? But yes, that was a very... Oh, hello. But yes, that was a very speedy spring playlist. Ooh, that was a mouthful. I am shocked. I actually got through that without stuttering. Yes, let me know what you guys have been listening to down below for sure so I can actually make this a decent length playlist, you know? Otherwise, be sure to check out all the songs and more videos to come for sure. And until then, I will see you in the next one. Bye.